So hello, welcome back to Go Again Gaming. My name is Az, and today you're going to be joining me as I pull my packs for the sealed Creators of Aria tournament that I'm going to be a part of with some awesome other creators. So stay tuned to everyone you normally stay tuned to because there's going to be a lot of people involved in this, including myself, which is great. So I'm not going to build the deck on camera because I'm going to ask for support from a lot of my patrons in my Discord as to what way they think I should go with this because I'm still relatively new to the game um, and these are going to be all fresh cards to me. I've had a few quick looks at the Tales of Aria and all that sort of stuff but haven't really delved into it uh, as, of, uh, as of now. So let me just go back to the gameplay map so you can see the Tales of Aria packs that I have sourced. I uh, got them from Total Cards in the UK, and they didn't think they had any issues with regards to their shipping, because I got them pretty much to set the next day. Um, so, uh, so yeah. Before we go into it, please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the little bell notification if you want to be notified of any future videos. And, uh, yeah, stay tuned to the channel, because I've got a lot of videos to come out over the next week or so with uh, a local game store slash venue in Southampton. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Um, so yeah, let's get straight away. Let's get straight into this straight away. And it's nice to see that they they've given me two of each hero. They've given me Oldim, Oldim, Briar, Briar, Lexi, Lexi. So we'll see what happens. So let's get straight into this. Uh, these are the only packs I've actually received so far as well uh, with regards to Tales of Aria. This is the first Tales of Aria I've ever opened. So uh, and the first first edition as well. I haven't opened any first edition on the channel before. So we've got Shiver token and Embodiment of Earth token. Let's just put that over there. Uh, so we're going to sort sort these into um, into different sections. So we've got Elemental, we've got Earth the Breakground, we've got Lightning Ball Lightning, we've got Earth Burgeoning, we've got Entwine Lightning for the Elemental Action uh, Normal. Then we've got Elemental Ranger Action for the Snapshot. Then we've got Channel Mount Heroic. Uh, as a majestic in this pack, and it's an earth action aura. So straight away we've got a good earth aura there. So that's uh, that's good. Uh, strength of Sequoia, nice sort of Amazonian looking woman there. Good stuff, and that's uh, elemental guardian action. Uh, then we got uh, Sutcliffe's suede hides, which might see some play in my Viscerai deck. We will see. So that's cool. Um, so I can go over there. Uh, Stir the Wildwood, Elemental Rune Blade. So we've got Elemental Ranger, Guardian. Uh, let's put that over there for now. Emerging Avalanche with the Elemental Guardian. Frazzle for the Elemental Ranger. Bramble Spark for the Elemental Rune Blade. And then uh, Elemental Guardian. And then Flake Out for the Elemental Ranger action. What to do with that strength of Sequoia? I can't remember. Did I put that in the right place? Yeah, I did. Cool. Uh, so let me just move these over so you can actually see what I've got. <clears throat> so I've got the Elemental Guardian cards there, Elemental Ranger cards there, and the Elemental Rune Blade cards there. I've got Elemental there, Earth there, Lightning here, um, and Ice. We haven't pulled any Ice yet by the looks of it. So it's looking like Earth straight away because of the Channel Mount Heroic, and we've got quite a lot of Earth cards there as well. So second pack, here we go. Titan's Fist for the Thor's Hammer token. Okay, Entwine Lightning for the Elemental action. Autumn's Touch for the Earth action. Uh, Shock Striker for the Lightning action. Icy Encounter for the Ice action, the first one we have. Strength of Sequoia again for the Elemental Guardian. Uh, Rites of Lightning for the Elemental Rune Blade action. And Lightning Press for the Lightning Instant action. Um, and then we've got Weave Lightning uh, for another shiny lightning action there, which was um, kitchen table card, runaways, generic equipment legs, uh, arcanic shockwave for the elemental rune blade, glacial footsteps for the elemental guardian, uh, dazzling crescendo for the elemental ranger, singeing steel blade for the generic rune blade. Uh, then we got entangle for the elemental guardian and chilling ice vein for the elemental ranger. Okay, so we get getting quite a few Elemental Ranger cards and Elemental Guardian cards so far. Not many Elemental Rune Blade cards. So it might have... Well, we'll see. We'll see. We've got four packs left. 
One Majestic so far in Channel Mount Heroic. A Shiver Token. And Oldim on the back there. Maybe it's going to be Oldim because I've got the token. I'm all about the aesthetics. Entwine Ice for the Elemental action. Winter's Grasp for the Ice action. Lightning Surge for the Lightning action. Polar Blast for the Ice action. Earth Law Surge for the Earth action. Evergreen for the Earth action. And Sigil of Suffering for the Generic Rune Blade, which is nice for Viserai, thank you. And uh, Overflex for the Ranger action. Uh, normal Ranger action, so I'll put that down there. Uh, Deep Blue for the net Generic Equipment. Rites of Replenishment for the Elemental Rune Blade. Snow Under for the Elemental Guardian. Ranger action, Overflex, again yellow. Elemental Rune Blade, Inspire Lightning. Mulch for the Elemental Guardian and Blizzard Bolt for the Elemental Ranger. Cool. Three packs left. <clears throat> Titan's Fist for the token, as well as Briar Warden of Thorns on the back there. Okay, Chill to the Bone for the Ice action. Heaven's Claws for Lightning action. Winter's Grass for the Ice action. Invigorate for the Elemental Standard. Uh, burgeoning for the Earth. Bolt and Shot for the Generic Ranger. And Lightning Press for the Lightning Instant. And then we've got Electrifier's Lightning Action. And then Mask of Lightning for the Lightning Equipment Arms. Uh, Arcanic Shockwave for the Rune Blade. Arcanic Rune Blade. Uh, well, Elemental Rune Blade. Glacial Footsteps for the Elemental Guardian. And Tangle for the Elemental Guardian. And uh, Chilling Ice Vein for the Elemental Ranger. Uh, Stir the Wildwood for the Rune Blade. And then we have the Thump for the Generic Guardian Action. Two packs left. It's looking like Lightning and Ice is looking good. So maybe Lexi. We will see. We will see. Range is a tough one though, isn't it? Rosetta Thorn token as well as Seismic Surge. Chill to the Bone for the Ice action. Heaven's Claws for Lightning action attack. Uh, Entwine Lightning for the Elemental action attack. Ice action Winter's Grasp. Ice action, I've got another Polar Blast, blue. Uh, weave Lightning again for the Lightning action. It's going to have to be Lightning, isn't it? And then Channel the Thunder Step. So I've got two channels. I've got Channel Earth and Channel Lightning in, this, in the same six packs. So that's pretty good, right? That's pretty good. So it's going to have to be Lexi, I think, isn't it? Lexi or Briar, because I've got both the channels in here. So that's pretty good. Lightning action, aura. And we've got a ball lightning shiny as well underneath that. Rotten old buckler for the uh, guardian equipment offhand, which is quite nice. Uh, elemental ranger with a flake out. Uh, Vela flash for the elemental rune blade. Strength for Sequoia again for the uh, elemental guardian. Uh, Buzz bolt for the elemental ranger. Elemental rune blade action, uh, rice of replenishment. And then snow under for the elemental guardian action. So one pack left. And then we'll have a quick look over the cards, but I think it's going to have to be Lexi. Potentially. We'll see. We'll see. Frostbite token. Lovely old job. And then we've got a young Briar on the back of there. So Invigorate for the Elemental Action Generic. Chill to the Bone. Uh, so Tomorrow for the Earth Action. Winter's Bite for the Ice Action. Vela Flash for the Elemental Rune Blade. Flash for the Lightning Action, which is good. And then weave ice for the ice action. And then seek and destroy shiny. Wow. Okay. Seek and destroy shiny. It's going to have to be Lexi, isn't it? That's lovely, isn't it? You can't really see it because of the fact it's a virtual camera. And it doesn't really pick up the foiling very well. But still... Uh, that is a, a shiny Majestic in Seek and Destroy. I think that's pretty good. Three Majestics from six packs. Oh boy. If you have a content creators out there looking at this. Yeah, you think I think I, I think you know I'm going Ranger. You think I know I'm going Ranger. Even though Lexi is the Ranger in the set and we've got Azalea on the art here, it doesn't matter in this case. So you can destroy for the majestic shiny rare there in that pack. That's uh, that's a great way to finish, isn't it? That's a great way to finish for the ranger action. 
Uh, Amulet of Lightning for the Lightning action. Uh, Elemental Rune Blade. Guardian action. Elemental Ranger. Elemental Rune Blade and Elemental Guardian and finishing off with Blizzard Bolt. So yeah. What do you think? I mean, again, I'm not going through all the cards that I got. I was just pulling out the uh, the packs and I'm going to ask my patrons and my Discord what they think I should go with here. But I do think it is looking like Lexi. Sheerly because of the Seek and Destroy that I just pulled there last minute as well as the big stack of Lightning and Ice cards um, as well as a big stack of Ranger cards uh, plus the Channel Thunderstep and the Seek and Destroy plus a few... Um, generic ranger actions, overflex, bolt and shot um, are looking like quite quite good options as well. So I'm thinking ranger. Um, with regards to equipment, you can use what you pull, can't you? Is that all you can use? I can't remember what the sealed... I've never played sealed in Flesh and Blood yet, so it's going to be interesting. So the, the, you can only use the cards you pull, is that right? So in that case, yeah, we've got Mark of Lightning, which is pretty good. Uh, we've got a Deep Blue, which we can use. Um, we've got obviously Shiver, which is her token weapon anyway. We've got Runaways. Um, and we've got Embodiment of Lightning on the back there, but that's for Briar. And then Suckless Suede High. So yeah, probably Runaways, Shiver, Deep Blue, and Mark of Lightning, I guess. Which is the whole set, apart from the gauntlets. We don't have any gauntlets. We have a chest, legs, and arms that we can use. Um, Put a card from your hand on the bottom of your deck, destroy Deep Blue, Deep Blue gain some resources. So yeah, I guess that's all right. Um, so yeah, I think we're going to be building Lexi, but I'll leave that for the comment section to uh, influence me, as well as obviously this video and these cards will be shared in my Discord channel, which obviously will be the link for that will be in the description box below. But thanks for very much for tuning in today. Uh, it's a quick and short one because I've got a lot of other work to do with regards to videos this week. Uh, but I thought I'd share my pools not only with my audience, Discord, and patrons, and all that sort of stuff, but the other creators as well. This is a good pack, I think, and I cannot wait to kick all your asses. Peace. Have a good one.